to my channel this is miss live right now so if you wanted to see how i achieved this look you know what you got to do stay tuned after i have used an eyeshadow primer to make my colors last longer i will be using different color eye pencils to correspond with the colors that i'm going to add to my lid and the purpose of doing this is so that the colors will be more vibrant and they will stay exactly where I put them and it will last all day. And now I am taking this purple eye pencil so that I can start my cut crease. But before I start this cut crease, I'm going to be patting on a yellow lime color eyeshadow. And then I will be patting right next to it an orange eyeshadow. And then... On the end of my eyelid, I will be using a hot pink eyeshadow. And then I will be going in with a smaller detail brush and blending in between those lines so that it can be more seamless in between the colors. I'm going back in with that eyeliner pencil and I'm showing you that I'm putting that in a V shape and I will be blending that out with a purple eyeshadow. But before I do that, I'm using a pencil brush to make sure that the line in between the cut crease and the mobile lid is very detailed. Now I'll be blending out that purple eyeshadow with a pink eyeshadow that has a purple undertone to it. And then I will be adding a silver color to the brow bone. And so that we have a seamless transition between the brow bone area and my crease area, I will be blending that out with a crease brush with a little bit more of that pink eyeshadow on it. Now I'll be taking a turquoise eyeliner and lining under my waterline. And then I will be patting on a corresponding eyeshadow that goes along with that eyeliner in a teal color. And just so I can add more depth to the look, I am taking a black eyeshadow and going back in my V area to get the look more interest. Don't forget to blend, blend, blend. And now I am showing you that I added eyelash glue and patted on some teal glitter to add a little sparkle to the look after adding lashes and a black liquid eyeliner i then will be going on to the lips i would be filling my lips in with this taupe color lip color and then I will be topping this off with a beautiful dual chrome lip gloss. And here we are with the finished look. Hopefully you like the way that this turned out. I am so excited to be participating in the next 2015 face awards don't forget to go check the website out and vote for your girl and as always be your own kind of beautiful because you my love are beautiful see you next time bye